everybody, welcome, welcome to my podcast. I'm going to talk about a very special topic. People talk about angels, so kids are angels, angels in heaven, archangels who fly, uh, fly up in the sky. Uh, we're not talking about kids are angels, we're talking about the real angels. The angels that have wings. Now, humans don't have wings, per se, as I would say. Um, they don't fly around our skies. They don't fly around our skies. We need a vehicle for that, as they say. Um, you can't fly around. We don't have wings. We only got hands. We don't have wings. Uh, <laughs> but that entailed, uh, we're talking about angels. Angels, that's like uh, God sends our angels. If you read it in the Bible, God sends angels, real angels. Now, the angels they talk about in the Bible are are. are, are uh, Mark, uh, Michael Angel. Uh, the wording in the Bible called the Mark Angel, or, uh, many angels, many angels. But I'm talking, uh, kids are not always angels, okay? Angels are people that save people. You know, angels are like angels that come and save you for many reasons, many situations in the world. Uh, to car accidents, to, uh, in the hospital, uh, to, uh, they're there when we need them. We're, they're there when they need God can't, uh, God sends their angels in the world, in real world, in the real sense. Angels are also spotted on, uh, on, on photos, videos. The media shows angels. Uh, when there's, when there's car accidents, after the, after the incident, there's angels nearby the accident. Um, uh, it shows it in the photos. Sometimes people will take photos and there's an angel nearby the accident, the car accident. Uh, that's why it's telling you it's there to uh, comfort the person that it, angel's right beside the person in the car accident. Uh, that's the angel we're talking about. So this topic has to do with angels in the world. I'm not talking about ki little kids are angels. You know, like uh, kids that are five years old angels. Um, yeah, uh, mothers call their kids angels. Well, not necessarily. Not necessarily. Uh, angels are, uh, the angels I like to talk about are the angels in the heavens, way up in the sky. Those are angels up in the sky. Uh, God sends our angels to help us as humans on this planet. Uh, wherever you may be on this planet, angels do come. Um, uh, people, uh, people actually pray for angels to come and help them. Uh, uh, sometimes when we want angels to come and help us, the uh, Bible does mention about angels in the Bible. In the uh, in King James Version to the uh, regular uh, Bibles. But they do men mention angels in the Bible. Now the angels that people really talk about are archangels, angels of heaven, and uh, angels that are have wings. Uh, it doesn't, it's a little weird for a lot of humans on the planet to look at angels that sort of way. But they describe angels have wings. Angels have wings. That's what they describe angels as. Uh, they have wings, they can fly around our skies. They're angels. And they don't go, they don't fly around like in, uh, like airplanes or anything. They fly around like humans and they have wings attached to their arms. Uh, they fly around, and they uh, sometimes they're always here on Earth to help us as humans. And that's what I'm going to run a topic today about angels. Just underline angels. Angels are basically, uh, angels are here to save us in this planet. Not God, not Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, but angels. That's every human on the planet. You got that out there, everybody? Angels are here to stay. And they're here to help the world. They're here to help the world. In pretty much every lifestyle that we are in. Uh, if we're ever in a hospital and we are in a coma, uh, God forbid we're ever in a coma, angels will be right beside us. Uh, they're there to protect the humans. Angels are there to protect the humans on this planet. Uh... They're there to help you. It could be very weird at the first time, but angels are very much real. Uh, 
They're here to, uh, to save the humans on this planet. You got that out there? Angels are here to stay on this planet to help the humans. Whatever situation they get into, a car accident, uh, if they're in a hospital and they're uh, almost about to die, angels are nearby our bedsides. Um, and they're there to help to make sure that the big transition from being alive to being dead. Uh, so they're there, they're there at the moment's notice. It's what you call the moment's notice. Um, if you pray a lot, uh, angels will come and save you every single time. Angels will always be there as humans on the planet. And God, uh, God sends our angels, that's what it says in the Bible. God sends our angels to help the humans on this planet. And it doesn't matter if you're a kid, doesn't matter if you're an adult, doesn't matter if you're a teenager, angels are there to help the person. If you pray a lot, if you pray a lot, everybody out there, angels will definitely come to you. And they'll say whatever situation you're in, uh, if it's a car accident and uh, all of a sudden you're involved in a car accident, angels will be right at near the car accident. That's the type of angels. They're there to save the humans. They're there to save the humans, just so you know. Uh, whatever situation they're in. Uh, and uh, uh, believe, just pray for the highest high, the highest high in the the, uh, uh, the heaven, the heavenly world. Jesus will forgive you everything, every, everything that people have done in this world. Jesus will forgive you, and most importantly, one hundred ten percent. Jesus will forgive us whatever sins we did, whatever whatever wrong we did. Uh, J Jesus will forgive us. He's in the business of forgiving for us humans. So, whatever, uh, whatever crimes you committed, yes, whatever crimes committed, uh, Jesus always forgives us humans. Whatever we have done bad in this world. We, uh, uh, we don't like to sin. The word you guys like to use is sin. We, we don't want to sin in the world. And uh, I want to iterate that. That's why I'm talking about angels and stereo, in the stereo cell. Uh, now, angels are always there when we need them. They have wings. Remember, these angels have wings. They're not like humans. They don't have wings. Humans do not have wings. In, theor in theory, that humans on the planet, like you and I, don't have wings. We don't fly around like Superman or, uh, um, we're to, uh, angels are, they have wings. God sends their angels. It says clearly in the Bible. And I want to talk about that in a harsh way. I want to talk about angels in a in a different perspective. In a let's let's do a deep a deep dive into this uh, subject called angels. And there's angels in songs. I almost forgot about that. Angels in songs. Uh, many singers out there have done the songs about angels. And there's referencing in music as well uh, of angels. Uh, the, uh, the Black Crows, if you ever heard of the rock group called the Black Crows, they have the word angels, in, uh, angel in the song. Uh, and I want to point that out. So the topic we're talking about today, today folks, is angels. Archangels, Mark, a uh, Michael, Angel. Um, we have angels in our world. Whatever, six, whatever sticky situation that humans get into, angels will always be there for us. Our bedsides to our to our hospital. They're there to help you out. It doesn't matter what situation you're in. They're always there. If you pray the ultimate prayer, angels will definitely come. It, 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 basically, angels are here to save the world, not destroy. They're here to save the world, to save the humans on the planet. Not UFOs, not aliens, not little gray, gray aliens. Um... Just, just basically angels. Angels are white. Uh, uh, people describe angels as white. As white. They wear a white gown, I think. This is what they describe angels as like. Uh, they have wings. As humans don't have wings. But they fly around our airspace. Our airspace, if you, get, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, yeah, angels are way up in the clouds. Way, way, way up in the clouds. Uh, those are angels that fly around uh, on our, in our skies, in our clouds of our skies, 
and they're de they're, if you pray the ultimate prayer, angels will come down on this earth and help the humans. And they're not like they're not like little gray men. They're not like that. They're not like aliens or anything. They're like uh, angels of heaven. They're like angels of heaven in a sterile sense. So there you go, folks. Angels are always there. If you pray the ultimate prayer, angels will definitely come. Remember, angels are, they have wings. That's in the real world. Humans do not have wings. They're not like Superman, okay? He flies around and he uses kryptonite. And I want to say that strongly. And, uh, so there you go. I'm going to talk about angels. Uh, there's angels in songs. There's angels in life. Uh, but don't go down the rabbit hole. I'm telling you people out there, do not go down the rabbit hole. Uh, that's what they say about a lot of things in the world. Do not go down the rabbit hole, the deep rabbit hole. Because you may, you may be burned. You may be burned about that. So don't go down the rabbit hole. I always tell, I'll tell people, don't be a victim. Don't be a victim, be a hero. You don't want to be a victim, so I tell all the humans on the planet today, don't, don't be a victim, be a hero. That's my word of advice. Be victory, have victories out there, have victories in stereo. Do the victory speeches. My friend once did, he did a victory speech. Have a victory speech and do it in a stereo sound set. I promise you guys I'll be the best that you can be at what I do. And uh, we are doing the best that we can uh, in terms of today. We almost got a week until a Merry Christmas to everybody out there, the world, the nation, and everywhere else. Merry Christmas to everybody and a happy, really freaking New Year. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. I'm going to say this before New Year comes around. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. I'm all excited about the New Year in 2021. I've talked about in previous videos. Happy New Year in the year 2021. I hope the coronavirus is long gone before then. Yes, and I just want to say that you can say whatever you want to say. Remember, we all have free speech. And I'm doing this for the podcast people out there. Just remember, believe in angels, believe in angels, and believe in Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior. He's the one who saves you. He's, he's not going to allow you to go to the depths of hell. You know, in depths of hell is where uh, where people scream blue murder in the depths of hell. So there you go, folks. Don't go in the grates of hell. Hell is a real place. I kid you not. Hell is a real place. You don't want to go there. You want to get Jesus to save you. He wants to take you up to the heavenly world, the heavens. The holy world. They call it the holy world to everybody. So let's, 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 uh, Let's do the ultimate prayer. God wants us to pray out there. The prayer, the ultimate prayer of our nation, of our nation. If we can do the ultimate prayer, God will hear our words, our speeches, our forgiveness. We all need to forgive ourselves out there on the planet today. Whatever sin you did, whatever crime you did, we need to be forgiven. We really do. And I, it's a time of need. Whatever crimes you did, just say to God, I, you forgive me, right, God? Just say that to yourself. And I'm going to say this in stereo sound, not mono sound. I will be right back after this commercial break. Stay tuned for more information.